Welcome back everyone to Moons and Pearls. I want to send a big thank you to each and every one of you guys for your love, for your support. I have been going through some things, but I am doing okay. Sometimes I'm doing better than others, but I want to thank you for your kindness, for your patience. It means the world to me. And I'm proud of us for being supportive um, of each other and well, here I am you guys. So I want to do a spiritual update for Aries. Aries, how are you doing? I hope you're doing great. I hope you're doing lovely. Um, any cross watchers welcome and uh, make sure you like, share, subscribe. So I know to come back and do more readings, you guys. Um, let's see what do we have in the current energy for Aries. Take the messages that resonate, leave the ones that don't. All right. All right, so we have dreams and action. So I feel like it's time for you to, to take action in your dreams. So um, I feel like you're in a stage of birthing something new in your life, something that you've dreamt of having for a long time. So let's see here. We also have a little bit of, um, of a blockage, but let's see. Then we'll get into your tarot. Um, let me know if these messages resonate, you guys. Advanced Momentum Movement Initiative. Um, consider where you are placing your energy. Give yourself permission to decide and move. You are in the driver's seat of your life. It is time to execute your plans. Know that you are guided as you take action in the world. As long as you listen to your inner guidance and act when your intuition, intuition urges you to do so. So creation, dreaming, illumination, inspiration, and dream interpretation. Um, find places, people, and ex experiences that inspire you. Allow your imagination to soar by opening the mind and allowing the space for fantasy and ideas. You will also tap into your creativity and your muses. Um, you are being asked by your higher self to pay attention to your dreams. If you find it hard to remember, your dream set intention before you go to sleep that you will remember them in the morning. Okay, so I feel like spirit, your angels are trying to give you messages through your dreams. Um, and then the blockage is the obligation, um, peer pressure, or just not feeling like you're living your purpose, like your life at this time. So let's get into your tarot and you guys, I feel like a little bit of adrenaline doing your reading, so I don't know if you feel excited or some good things going on with you guys. Let's see what's going on and what's happened in the recent past for Aries. Recent past for Aries. Recent past for Aries. Okay, so there's definitely communication, forward movements, moving away from anxious nights, depression, sadness. Tell me more spirit about this recent past. Oh, you guys, let's see. Recent past for Aries. There's someone in your energy, Aries, that was very lustful, okay? Someone that didn't respect their body and themselves and they used a lot of emotional manipulation. Um, I don't know that this is you. I feel like this is their energy. I don't know if they've been trying to message you or trying to manifest you back in their life, recent past, crying to you. Tell me more about this energy that's been, that's around, they're trying, Okay, this is what I see from this person because their energy is very heavy. Um, I don't know if they feel like they've, they've lost you, um, but I almost feel like what they're telling you or what they've said to you is to put you into like mental confusion in the recent past. Um, I feel like they're trying to offer you something that it's not real. It's like a fake coin, a fake apology, a fake something. And they're trying to convince you as if they were trying to convince themselves. And because they are in a karmic energy, it doesn't resonate with you. 
like what they're saying doesn't even make sense to you. Tell me more about uh, recent past for Aries. You are, um, I feel like moving on, you're, you've moved on, you've, you, you've manifested a, a, a victory. Um, like you've picked up these challenges and you, you're walking victorious with these challenges like you are i feel like people are side eyeing you a little bit like where did this person come from um but that's awesome let's see what's in your current energy spirit tell me about aries their current energy i don't see you giving any offer or any attention to any specific person you're withholding emotion i feel like you know your value you know a little bit stubborn um but you're i feel like you're being stubborn not in a bad way just um you're not gonna let people sway your mind as how they were able to do it before so this is why you you don't show emotion at this time someone's trying to return to you because they miss you. I don't know, Aries. Uh, let's see what's in uh, your current energy, more about current energy. You've gained clarity. Um, I feel like you, this wasn't a happy place. I feel like uh, this person's impatient. They keep coming up. But be Sagittarius or a fire sign. Um, you've gained clarity and I feel like it made you think of how you used to be defensive all the time. You were on walking on eggshells um, and you're like a wounded warrior. So it's like this person or these people come around you and you're like, why do you want to talk to me now um, after everything I've been through? Um, and this person is impatient, almost like pushy. You're moving forward. There's a justice system, like you're being blessed you're victorious. I see, like we have, I like what you moving forward to a new life. Um, very royal. It's what I see for you, Aries. Uh, let's see what's coming in the near future for Aries. The star might be Aquarius. Dreams coming true, uh, manifesting. Um, I also see grounding for you. So I don't know if you've traveled or you want to travel mountains, hot springs, something like that. Um, the lovers in reverse. Maybe also Gemini, a lot of air sign here. Okay, you're not taking action towards love. You're more manifesting into an abundant lifestyle. And you're not gonna give an offer. You're withholding it. Um, and you're not accepting either. <laughs> you're not. You're not giving, you're not accepting, you're just pouring into yourself, which is, there's nothing wrong with that at this point in time. Yep. Everything's in reverse. So you're not wanting to talk. You're not wanting to hear. You just want to focus on yourself and continue being victorious and, and awesome. This was a great reading. Let's see, what do we have here from the universe, you guys? Holy guys. Let me know if these messages resonate. Um, it's always fun to read your guys' messages. Um, tell me more, Spirit. Um, conclusions are within reach. Yeah, you've closed this ch chapter. A time for healing. Exactly. You are devoting this time for yourself. You're not taking. You're not giving. You are a romantic. A new romantic cycle begins. Nothing will come of this situation. One more, Spirit. You and your loved ones are safe. Hmm. Well, let's see. What do we have here um, from our angels for Aries spirit? What messages do we have from our angels for Aries? Communicate clearly, perfect timing, and compromise. So I wanna say communicate clearly I just, you're not talking, so I don't know, maybe you need to be more direct with this person or, and this situation requires very precise and careful communication. Don't assume that others involved understand what you want or need from them. 
In-person discussions are, are preferable, but if that's not possible, make sure that you communicate, your communication method is very thorough. This card can indicate that there has been a miscommunication that is creating a challenge for the parties involved. By clearing up any misunderstandings, you can heal the situation so that everyone can start moving forward again. So we have moving forward for you guys. All right, if any of these messages resonated, you already know what to do. Like, share, subscribe so we can see you soon. Ciao.